welcome to mathematics online lecture lecture series by professor k vinar sumam lending institute of engineering technology vijayanagaram now this is the second lecture on multiple integrals okay. now today we will discuss about another problem measure on double integrals problem evaluate double integral of x y dx dy x y dx dy where r is the r is the region bounded by r is the region bounded by the x axis x axis ordinate x equals to 2a and the curve x equals to 4a y so first we will discuss about the region region so our region our region is bounded by our region is bounded by uh, three three curves one is x axis other one is x equals to 2a and other one is x square equals to 4a y now x square equals to 4a y is a parabola which is passing through our region and symmetric about by axis now this is the first first curve and second curve second one is second curve is x equals to 2a which is a straight line parallel to y axis and it is passing through the point 2a equals to 0 and third curve is x axis now first we will solve the two curves x, x square equals to 4a y and x equals to 2a for finding the point of intersection so first curve x, x square equals to 4a y and the second curve is x, x equals to 2a now subduing x equals to 2a in the first equation in this equation then replace x by 2a 2a whole square 2a whole square equals to 4a y that is 4a square equals to 4a y now cancel 4 4 and a a finally you will get y equals to a when x equals to 2a y becomes a the point of intersection of these two curves is 2a comma a now now we will observe the region region bounded by the three curves first one is x axis okay this is x axis and second one is second one is a parabola x square equals to x square equals to 4a y x square equals to 4a y and third one is third one is x equals to 2a now if you observe x equals to 2a if you observe the three curves x axis and straight line parallel to y axis x equals to 2a and parabola the closure region is this one now this is the required region r now we will evaluate the integral over this region now the given integral is double integral of x y dx dy now first we will find the limits of y axis along y axis if you observe along y axis the lower curve is x axis x axis means y equals to 0 x equals to 0 and up to the line the curve this is the curve up to this curve this curve is y equals to y equals to x square by 4 a x square by 4 a so y varies from y equals to 0 to x square by 4 a now this is the limits for y then x limits x limits here the point of intersection is 0 0 clearly this is 0 0 and this is 2a comma 0 2a comma 0 if you observe Along x axis, the limits x equals to 0 to x equals to 2a. x equals to 0 to x equals to 2a. Now, x limits are x is 0 to 2a. First, we will integrate with respect to y, then integrate with respect to with respect to x. First, integral x is 0 to 2a. Inside integral is x into integral y is 0, 0 to x square by 4a y dy into dx. 
first we will integrate with respect to with respect to with respect to y here by integral y equals to using the integral formula x power n dx equals to using this formula known formula x power x power n plus 1 by n plus 1 x power n plus 1 by n plus 1 using this formula integral y equals to y square by 2 remaining things are same x into y square by 2 y limit 0 to x square by 4a now substituting the limits first put a y equals to x square by 4a then y equals to 0 replace y by y by x square by 4a in this expression then minus sign put replace y by 0 put y equals to 0 then x square by 4a whole square is nothing but x power 4 by 16a square already divided by 2 here now x into x power 4 that is x power 5 by 32a square now first now we will integrate with respect to x only x now integral x power pi again we are using the same formula integral x power n dx integral x power n dx formula integral x power pi is x power 6 by 6 the remaining constants are same 1 by 32 into a square x square x, x power 6 by 6 limits from 0 to 2 a put x equals to x equals to put x equals to 2a in this expression 2a whole power 6 by 6 minus if you put x equals to 0 0 now 2 power 6 2 power 6 is 64 a power 6 by 6 th here 32 and 32 and uh, 64 both are cancel x a square and a square cancel finally you will get a power 6 by 3 so finally our required integral value integral x is 0 to 2a integral y is 0 0 to x square by 4 a x y dx dy equals to a power 6 by 3 thank you so if you have any doubts contact through email my email and also through whatsapp whatsapp number thank you thank you very much and yeah.